Welcome back, guys. I'm here, y'all, with another video. This is a collective read, guys. So, this is going to be for every sign. All right. If this video resonates with you, then be sure to hit the like button, guys. That's a beautiful way to energetically um, donate to the channel as well as share with your family and your friends and comment below. All right. So, let's get into it. What message is there for the collector? What does the collector need to know? What's going on with the collector? Oh, that jumped right out. Oh, okay. I'm seeing somebody who was just basic a little while ago, done swerved in another lane and done turned all the way up. Like, like somebody who was very low key has now is now like all over the internet okay i'm getting that somebody was just basic like somebody was just like you know doing the regular routine was just in a regular routine now they have swerved into a whole new lane. I'm talking about slaying left and right. Like, it's, it just came from out of nowhere. It was like this person was so low-key because they, they was living kind of like low-key. That's why it's showing basic here. This could be y'all. This could be someone that you're dealing with, someone that you know. But for some of you, I think I feel like this could be your energy. I feel like you've swerved in another lane. You uh, you are no longer in this energy here, like they're staying at home, just kind of like chilling out at the house. Now you you done turned it up uh, like five or six, seven, eight, nine, ten notches. Okay. And I feel like you know, at one point in time you was just kind of like on you know on a low quiet. But now it's like loud and it's just loud and proud <laughs> all over the internet. Like all, everybody's looking, okay? Everybody's watching. I feel like for a lot of you, we got spiritualists. You could be manifesting. You could be looking at something, a bigger goal. You got some type of gold in mind, something that you're trying to manifest. So you're looking, not only are you thinking it, you're looking apart as well too. I see that. Okay, so that's beautiful. Let's see. Tell me what else. What else is going on with the collective? What does the collective need to know? We got lovers and courtship. Ooh, it looks like y'all got new love coming in. Or y'all just lovey dovey with y'all partner that y'all got now. Yeah, somebody could be returning. For some of y'all, y'all could be in a long distance relationship. I see you and this person connecting, coming back together. Yeah, like y'all got y'all got it going on right now. Like y'all are pulling, dragging people back in. Y'all really throwing that fisher pole back and <laughs> reeling people in. Yes, I love it. Some of y'all may have a choice between multiple people. But I'm getting a lot of courting going on, a lot of love making going on. I'm seeing trips as well, too. Like you could be going on vacation with someone. For those of you who aren't like in a relationship, you could be finding you a little boo thing, a little sneaky link. But yes, I'm loving this energy. Like it's like love all across the board, either way it goes, even if it's long distance. I feel like someone could be returning to you. Um and I'm getting nice. Some of y'all got y'all some little sneak and got a little sneaky link. But the lovers is here as well too. So love life is looking a little juicy. Okay, so let's pull from the love oracle. What's coming in for the collective? What does the collective need to know? What's coming in for the collective? What does the collective need to know? Yeah, some of y'all are getting to know someone. Okay, this person that's coming in. See, yeah, we got flirt, heart-to-heart -heart conversation, and worth waiting for. <sighs> See, some of y'all are getting to know somebody 
getting to know somebody. There may have been some, like, this person could have deceived you or you feel like this person is wearing like a mask and maybe there's more that you need to know about this person so it looks like a lot of y'all are going to be kind of like flirting until it's time to have that conversation but there's something that you feel like this person could be hiding but you're gonna i feel like some of y'all gonna stick it out to see what's what like are they hiding you know the fact that they have children because we got children right here you know exactly what it is that you deserve and i feel like this person is super duper attractive to you as well i feel like the chemistry is bomb okay the chemistry is bomb but i feel like for some of you this is somebody new because we got new love here for some of you this is somebody new for this new person coming in for those of you who have new love coming in it looks like you may be trying to figure this person out you're trying to see what they're lying about what are their flaws what are they hiding is there something that you need to know i feel like you're going to be flirting until it's time to have that conversation. And then I feel like some of y'all are feeling like, you know, it's worth the wait. All right, so let's talk about the ones who are currently in love. Okay, so the collective that is currently in love, what's coming? Oh, we got engagement. We got an engagement. New love in past life relationship. Okay, so for the ones who are already bundled up, it looks like there could be some type of engagement, okay? I feel like engagement could actually be like being proposed to um, or is taking things to the next level. Now, with new love, someone could have a, a, a new love coming in. This could be you could have someone new trying to come in or your partner could have someone new trying to come in. I'm, a, I'm definitely going to um, look more into that. But it looks like someone from the past. So somebody new is coming in and somebody has someone coming from the past. Or this could definitely be too. This could be this new person that you are very, very close to. You guys have been kicking it for a while. And this person wants to take things to the next level with you. Um, but you still have someone from the past who's trying to come in. Okay. Somebody could be trying to let get their friends to help them to try to come back. Okay. I'm getting like this new person that you're dealing with. This person that is, you know, you've been freshly kicking it with. I would say maybe one to three years. You want this connection to go to the next level. But someone from the past, let's clarify. Oh. Yeah, see, you've healed. I'm getting healing hard in Phoenix. So it looks like you're, and look at this engagement ring. So someone definitely wants to get engaged, but someone is closing out a chapter of being hurt. So somebody is trying to close a chapter. Okay, now tell me why new love is here. Photograph. This is looking at your photos, missing you, nostalgia, making new memories. So some of y'all are making new memories with this new person. This person has your heart, okay? And see, you're not hurt anymore over this past person. You got heartbroken and a grim reaper. So you're no longer crying over spilled milk over this past person. You have a new love interest that you're wanting to take things to the next level with, okay? So we got past life relationships. Well, we got not today, I told you, this person from the past, you're still angry at them. You're still upset with them. You've closed this chapter, okay? You don't want to, you're avoiding talking to this person from the past. It's this new love interest here that you want to take things to the next level with, all right? So, all right, so we got the ones and then we got this. All right, so let's pull, um... Let's pull a few cards and let's see what other messages we can get. What else does this collective need to know? What's coming towards the collective? I'm getting seeing a whole lot of abundance. 
a new fresh mindset like i'm getting like i'm just going off based off the first read where it's just like the energy was like rags the riches not saying that y'all ain't have shit i'm just saying that it was more like you was just in like a chill mode. Like it wasn't too much going on. It was like a day-to-day -day routine. And it's like today you is so different from yesterday you. And it's kind of like it happened overnight. Like it happened so quick. Okay, so let's see. I'm getting like y'all release some things. Y'all let some things go. Y'all let some hurt go. Some pain go. Um, and you're welcoming in new energy. All right, let's do it right here. Yes, look at the strength card here. Seven of Wands. Y'all done overcame some type of obstacle. You're realizing your strength and your ability, okay, to get over something, okay, to get over something. You're looking forward. You're looking ahead. You're looking at the ships that's coming in, okay. I'm getting somebody asking you a bunch of questions. Could be a masculine here with this. I'm getting, this could be like a boyfriend, a husband, or even a father. Because we got the emperor and the four of wands. I'm getting somebody asking asking you a lot of questions. Okay, like where is all of this coming from? That's what I'm hearing. Where is all of this coming from? I have so many questions. That's what I'm hearing. Where is all of this coming from? I have so many questions. Where did you get all of this from? Where did I, where did this come from? That's what I'm hearing. Where did it where did this come from? I have so many questions. Okay. I see some of y'all could be kind of afraid or nervous to let your guard down because you could feel like you're going to end up regretting it. I see you busy. I see you busy manifesting. Look at this Ace of Pentacles. Y'all are manifesting something. The Magician and the Ace of Pentacles. Y'all are definitely on manifesting something. For sure, for sure. This per whoever this is on the outside looking in they're completely like they're searching for clues they're kind of like they're secluded from you they're they're not around you they're not in your space so they don't understand see this the magician is over here looking down the hermit is turned the complete opposite way it's like they don't even they can't even get in to see what it is that you're that you're working on that you're manifesting but whatever this is that you're working towards we got an ace of pentacles as this outcome so this is something that's going to be a something great something grand something new something fresh an opportunity this is god handing you an opportunity okay so whatever this is that you're working on that you're building that you're doing you're doing it I see you right here with this Queen of Wands energy. The Queen of Wands energy is very enterprising. Like, her energy is very go-getterish, hustler-type energy, especially with this Queen of Wands and the Magician. I'm getting real deal hustler. Like, you could be on your grind right now. You're on your grind. It's like that's all you think about. That's all you think about is forward movement, okay? That's all you're thinking about is forward movement. How am I going to move forward? What am I going to come up with next? Yeah, see, look at this. Queen of Pentacles, Nine of Pentacles, Temperance. Like, you have, you're secure. Like, that's all you think about is being secure, having security. That has been on your mind a lot lately. So you're in the lab, <laughs> you in the lab cooking up some, like it is what it is. And you're very much so in your empress, emperor energy. Okay. So this is very beautiful. You're very beautiful, attractive, good looking. Um, you have a pretty soul, a pretty mind. You're very much so in your empress or emperor energy. Moon. Ooh, you have like this mystical energy about yourself. Yeah, see, you're working on things in private. I feel like 
you're very mysterious at this time. You're very mysterious. And look at this masculine over here. The Empress and the Emperor. You got a masculine over here that's coming through to seeing what you got going on. Yeah, they want to keep you like right in, in their view. Oh, now this person could be waiting for you to mess up. Oh, somebody said they didn't know that the love was that strong. Yeah, this person, this masculine, is the one who has so many questions. Tell me about this emperor over here. What's going on with this emperor? This emperor could feel like you're you're hiding something. Queen of Swords. So they're, they could be pissed. They're pissed off right now. This masculine energy is kind of pissed off at you. They feel like you're taking your time to reach out. They didn't think that you was going to call or tell everybody about, uh, I'm getting like relationship business. Other than that, um, they think that you're doing a good job. Okay, so they got a problem with with some of the some of their business or you guys' business being swirled around. Okay, why is this Queen of Swords and this Emperor here? Who? Tell me more about this masculine energy. This this uh, we got Mira that wanted to jump. Tell me more about this uh, Emperor energy. Okay, so this masculine over here is definitely like mirroring you. Like, I'm getting taken notes. I'm getting taken notes. I hear a lot of gossiping conversations. Like, you're in someone's conversation and they're talking about you. Possibly to family. We got palm tree in paradise. Possibly to like family. Could be to their mother. With that empress here, their parents. We got the masculine and feminine energy here. I'm getting like they're the ones they I'm getting like they, they feel like you're trying to hide something. I told you they don't know where this is all this is coming from, but they taking notes. They taking notes, okay. They don't think you should tell everybody about the relationship or what's going on. But other than that, they feel like you're doing a good job. Okay, so tell me why the magician is here. The Four of Wands. I'm getting like y'all making everything comfortable. Y'all making y'all living arrangement comfortable. Some of y'all are just like security, okay? You're, you're manifesting security. And it's like when this, when people come in and see what you're doing or what you did, people are going to be so surprised and shocked that you could come back and be this happy. Like you could start, I'm getting like some of y'all had to start over. I'm getting like some of y'all had to um, start from scratch. Okay. And it's like, look at me now. Look at me now. Yeah, see, the thing of it is, is I'm getting like y'all getting a little bit of payback for somebody who tried to run off, okay? Somebody tried to run off, and they ain't did what they were supposed to do. And even for some, I'm here like somebody tried to run off on the plug, I'm just saying. Like, somebody could have tried to run off on you, maybe place the order of some type, and then tried to get the money back for it or something. I'm getting like somebody going to regret that they tried to run off on the plug. Why is the Nine of Pentacles here? the chariot but best believe best believe y'all just y'all having to come up
somebody feel like you would have said something by now. Somebody feel like you got, like you too focused on what's in front of you. Somebody is feeling like you should have said something to them by now. I'm seeing that as well. Now, like I said, the person or people who are on the outside looking in, they got their backs turned. Yeah, but they're still trying to figure out what it is that you're working on. Like, they're looking for flaws or something. Like, I'm getting like that. Why is the seven of swords here? Like, they're sneaking. Why is the seven of swords here? The devil. Could be a Capricorn. They're looking for flaws. Somebody's looking for flaws. Looking for inconsistency. Looking for... Somebody's coming around looking for a flaw. Okay. So they can talk about you. Okay. Some of y'all could have just went through some type of heartbreak or sorrow, divorce, something like that. Like, I feel like there was some something that you went through. And it could have been a while ago. But I feel like I feel like people who talked about you, they talked about you like a dog. Um, and now it looks like they're confused because it don't make sense. When they see you, you look happy. Okay, you look happy when they see you. So it's confusing them. But they're definitely looking for flaws, definitely looking for inconsistencies in whatever it is that you're manifesting, whatever you're working on. Um, they're looking, they're looking for flaws. This person, you th may think this person isn't paying any attention, but they definitely are. They got their backs turned, but they can have spies other people coming and giving them information they're looking for your flaws they're looking for a flaw they've been looking for a flaw oh gosh i'm getting whatever it is that you're working on it's gonna be so grand and so big i'm hearing job well done i'm getting quick results as well too I'm hearing quick results. Somebody got some fast results on something that they was working on manifesting. You got some fast results. Now, the Ace of Pentacles is the outcome. And the Ten of Cups. Y'all are financially stable. You're happy. You're feeling yourself. You're in a good space um, financially and emotionally. And I absolutely love this energy okay you're making your lifestyle you're building your lifestyle you're building your empire um all of this energy here i feel like you're tired of being worried tired of stressing out you know it's to the point now that it, it caused you to have so much you know keep your guard up but i feel like now you can talk about that stuff it's old news now you're moving forward you're moving forward. Yes. You know it was going to happen. It just took some time. See, yeah, I feel like somebody wants you to be hurt. Somebody still wants you to hold on to some type of pain that I feel like you got over. <laughs> You're free from that. You're free from this pain. It's somebody else's turn. Whoever thought, whoever was over here looking and whispering talk about you it's their turn to get their karma what they deserve you already went through your struggle your pain whatever this part of the story is you've already overcame it now it's your turn to be abundant it's your turn to be happy it's your turn to manifest your desires okay and i see forward movement and progress from here now the people who are sitting back talking and watching and laughing and got so much to say they're gonna sit back and they're gonna get their karma because they they gonna come too all right, so that's what I got for y'all. Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. I'm going to chat with y'all later.